What's going on, everybody? Um, fortunately, this is day two of me putting in my exhaust headers. Um, but, uh, yeah. Uh, here we go with the clips. So, enjoy. <laughs> So yeah, um, I had some major bolt issues going on on both sides, and uh, it was being a pain in the butt. Um, so yeah, uh, let me show you the video on that real quick. So yeah, once I was able to get that pesky bolt off on both sides of the block, I was able to get the gasket on bolt the manifold, both manifolds on, and uh, started up because it was too late at night and I didn't want to keep up my neighbors, but I realized that uh, I was getting a lot of air uh, from the bottom of the manifold, and I'm like, okay, what's, what's going on? Buzz, cut that out. Come on, buddy. Stop digging holes. The dog's over here digging holes. Buzz, stop that. Stop it. Bugger. So yeah, my f camera is starting to get a little fuzzy, but um, let me show you uh, the video, I mean, by uh, where the air was coming from, all right, for my uh, headers. Something. See, I got the gasket. Check this out. I don't know if I can focus in on it. See how it's, come on, come on, focus in, there we go, you see how it's full, 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 gap, look at that massive gap right there, all the sealant that's inside in between this has gone out, that's what I'm, I'm getting, some air going through my headers so I we are gonna go run over and yeah get some new gaskets those are shit uh, I'm gonna have to go run out to I'm just gonna go run over to uh, advanced auto and just pick up what I need or an auto zone you know um, I'm not gonna drive 35 40 minutes away to O'Reilly's over in Wilson so but yeah let's go for a ride well now that we're going to our local auto zone I'm in my wife's car it's a 07 lacrosse so we're gonna go run out real quick and, uh, get the new gasket hate spending more money than I need to on something that I've already ordered but we do what we have to do right so I'm gonna run over real quick get the gasket I'm gonna get some air fresheners and so I can clean my wife's car later on this evening I still got I gotta cut the grass and stuff too so and that's how uh, we roll when it comes to Owning your own home and an acre and a half of land, you gotta maintain it, so. But yeah, I will check you guys here in a little bit. We're gonna go get this gasket, come back and install everything, and yeah. All right, guys, so we, we just pulled in my local auto zone. I'm gonna get the new gasket real quick, and then, uh, yeah. All right, guys. I finally got I got the gaskets in. They look amazing. I'm looking forward to putting these in. I'll show you guys real quick. So 
I got these new gaskets compared to my old gaskets. So those look so much better. And those will fit. Those are my old one. Well, those are supposed to be brand new gaskets. And yeah, it's got this. It blew everything up in the middle of it. So those are garbage, but these look amazing. I'm, I'm loving these new gaskets. And I picked up a couple of other things. I, I have, uh, oh, I don't speak Spanish, sorry. Uh, clamp, two and a half inch clamp, so that they're, I hide my exhaust properly and it'll sound a lot better. And uh, got that for my wife for the car. So, yeah, let's get back to the house, bolt everything up, and uh, see how it sounds. All right, I'm back. So I've got a couple of the bolts. I got this bolt and I got that bolt I'll put on in the rear and the front. I got the new gasket sitting. It looks 10 times better than the old gasket. We're going to get the headers on. Um, and then, yeah, uh, hopefully we can get this bad boy started and running. We'll bolt it up. and. Uh... All right, guys. Well, this is uh, this is my end result. And I got to get the other side. It's bolted up. It's nice and tight. Got the new gasket on. Hopefully it'll be it'll be good. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get this little bolt over here. So, uh, but it's tight enough on four four bolts. Now I need to just go ahead and get this off. Replace the bolts on this one. And then, yeah, we'll start the truck up and see how she sounds, or he sounds. All right, I finally got everything buttoned up and ready to go. Uh, so I had to use some spacers in there, if you don't, if you can't see down there. Let me show you. In order for the exhaust to stay, but let's give this a start. Moment of truth. Here we go. What do I do with the keys again? Oh yeah, keys are in the truck. Alright. Here we go, moment of truth. Finally, we're done and got everything bolted up. Now, all that's left to do is to button up the flange. Nothing's leaking anywhere else. That's that. Um, so, uh, it took two days to do, uh, but there was a lot of issues and stuff. So, uh, I had a bolt issue. I had a gasket issue. Uh, fitment. So, my dogs are playing like crazy right now, and they're, uh, my one dog, my Australian cattle dog that you see right there with the skunk looking tail, or the raccoon looking tail, alright, she's the barker, she can wake up people for miles, so, but anyways, I'm done, I'm out of here guys, see you guys next time, peace.